Hello everybody and welcome back to the Pokemon Diamond series. I know I ended up on a Friday because I wanted to save all of this for this week. Like save Mars and Return of Mars for this week and Gardenia for this week and Jupiter for this week. So that's what I wanted to do. Anyways, I am Mike Westerson and as I said in the last episode, we... Well, in the last episode, we got a lot of critical heads. But also, we did get ourselves the Galactic Key. I think I got it. The Works Key. We got that. In today's episode, we're be going through that Galactic Warehouse right there in Value the Works. Obviously, also in the last episode. Quite a weasel. Very nice Pokemon. Very strong. But it's very frail. And I, once again, if I have to bring the nature chart down. So. I might, have to, I might have to keep one down here for myself, like a little piece of paper for a chart. Or maybe have it on a whiteboard or something. I don't know. I might have to put it on a whiteboard or something. I'm not sure. Can't wait for the bike, which is after the second gym. That's nothing I can't wait for. So you can tell I'm kind of a little weird because I'm using the... I'm using the Emulators, touch pad, touch screen, touch screen, uh, what's it called? The emulator's D-pad. Oh, I can't just open it. It's not like red and blue where you get the secret key and it just opens. The secret key to Blaine's gym. Anyways, I do, but anyways, also this week we might catch our final, <clears throat> our final teammate. Might not be a good Pokemon, it might, it might. Some of you might think it. Let's check these ones for a second. Uh, let's look at this up. Uh, some of you might not think it's a good Pokemon, but I do need a decent Steel type. A, a Steel type would do good for this team, and I think the final teammate would be fantastic with a Steel type. You guys can guess the Steel type. If you get it right, I will I will heart your comment. <laughs> not in a homophobic way, but like I don't know anything about that, but like. In a way that you got the question right, I will hardly comment. Basically, you're like, oh, you got the Pokemon right. That's in my final teammate with this playthrough. Yep, well, you're my fifth and final teammate until I get the Dark Shock. Okay, I can't use. Because Dark Shock is a favorite Pokemon. That's one of my favorites. And I'm actually using it in a radical right playthrough. Like I did for like the past three nights. So if you want to follow me on Twitch, just the TV says my channel still walk on 619. And you can get my Twitch on you can follow me on Twitch. Like that. Or if you're in a server that I'm in, I can probably potentially send you a link to the Twitch. Or I can DM you the link to the Twitch. Or I could just say that I'm streaming. Okay, now we use Battle Commander Mars. I'm not really nervous about this battle. I'm only nervous about the probably because that thing is very high in attack. But maybe what I do. Right? I'm not sure if I'm sure if Torment would go, but Torment would if I had Torment. It's part of the thing would be fine. There's not going to be no new, evolu no, no new evolutions to the set to the like, I'd say at least by the Third gym. Let's see, Quartal. Because Blue's all level 26. <laughs> okay. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Awesome. okay, you basically just wasted a turn. You just, you just basically wasted a turn and you just toxic. And I'm poison. I do have a couple little white board down here so I could potentially just write down the nature it's like <coughs> like say docile as a new thing so I'll like, you'll have like I'll have the like, nature is like plus and minus and then I'll have another thing that has mood from me okay I think the plane here is going to start with you Get some chip damage in with a quick attack in your roost. I know that it's gonna go for fake out. Because that's what it has. So do I have any moves like okay. Ooh, there we go, the attack drop. I forgot about that. Yeah, I can just drop this thing. I can switch into last yeah. I didn't do this in Radical Red last night against my rival. 
and his electric type, which is Electivire. I had to basically switch in and out between my Luxray and my Staraptor. Because then there I have a Luxray and Staraptor. I switch up between Luxray and Staraptor. Basically drop this thing's attack by like three or four. And then switch and then basically switch to another Pokemon. Probably like my Garchomp and also my Garchomp. So now we're gonna go no, with my Inferno because these things had minus three attack. And I wanna start chipping some damage in with uh not pump. I do, and then I went with my Garchomp Bulldoze. Because <clears throat> it's the thing with Bulldoze. Still sucks that Garchomp doesn't get Earthquake as a level up move. Well, if I remember correctly, it doesn't get Earthquake as a level up move. The best level up ground type move this thing gets <clears throat> is Dig. It gets Bulldoze, it does get Sand Tomb. That will suck. It's weak, it's inaccurate, and it's not the for Garchomp with the special attack. And you don't want a special attack in a dark time. <clears throat> so, yeah. And also, um, what was I going to say? I don't know what I was going to say. Black Sand 2, other than it's weak, it's inaccurate. And this is most of the time special for Drug of Earth Up, but doesn't have to say about it. I mean, this is definitely worth the, the switch, switching out. Because I know, well, actually, I'm going to definitely have to do this. This is also practice for when I'm going to do this for Jupiter. Because I'm going to have to do this for Jupiter against her Stim Tank. Definitely going to do this against her Stim Tank, because I think that's nice slash. Oh, what's the ability? I'm trying to think of some type of ability. Aftermath. It might have Aftermath, so I don't mind about Aftermath damage. But if I had a ground type, I would probably be Magnitude. Maybe we could just catch a Geodude just for the gym. Or just for the gym. Just for the, the battle, and I could just maybe drop this thing's attack for like three. Drop this thing's attack by like three, like I did with this, this uh. Horribly. And then I can switch into my Geodude and possibly get a Magnitude in. I'm just gonna do a quick save, I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back from the quick save. The reason why I did a quick save is just in case this thing crashes. Because emulators tend to crash a lot. <clears throat> I was thinking, but I was like, no, I'm definitely gonna have Spark by the time I get to the I was thinking about catching a Rotom. But also, I realized, I looked up, to, looked up Rotom's moveset. And holy crap, it is garbage. It is absolute trash. It is like probably one of the worst moves that I've ever seen for a Pokemon. It's like it learns Discharge Level 50. It doesn't even learn Shadow Ball or anything. Like all of its good moves are literally from TMs. That's it. Like Shadow Ball, Thunderbolt. That's really the only good move it gets on the TM. Like, other than that, it's level up moves. And my. Alright, I'm back from that crash. That's another thing I wanted to expect. Good thing. It's a good thing I kind of did a quick save, but after uh, defeating Mars. Because that's gonna happen a couple times in the series. Or this game playthrough. A couple crashes. But like I was saying with Rotom, its moveset is garbage. I mean, it does get Thundershock and Astonish on the line, which are decent, like. But like, as it levels up, you're basically gonna have to deal with Thunder Shock until level 22, which is Shockwave. Shockwave is not a bad move. Shockwave is base 60 power, never misses. It's a good move, but then you're gonna have to wait till level 50 to get Discharge. Which is a decent good move, but once again, I could have learned like Thunder at level 50 and then like level 34 could learn Fish Tank. To be fair, they could have done that. But I guess they didn't want to do that. Oh, critical hit. Wow. I did not need a critical hit there, I think. But it would have been dead anyway, still. We got level 16 level that. Nice. I'll take level 16. Yeah, 
make myself make a quick repel. I can't say anything. Get a quick repel. I should do the honey tree and I can come back tomorrow and check what it is. I don't know. It's a hiker right here, so it's most likely gonna have rock type Pokemon. I can either use Monferno or Weasel. I'm gonna use Weasel. Star Ivy is actually Star Ivy actually kinda of caught up with everybody. Let me get this item. Got battle this guy. Oh, let's just cut the video. Oh, I can press the touch button so I can just use all the bottom screen for the gameplay. Yeah, that guy's really gonna have rock type. Weasel should take it out with him. Okay, it's the water gun actually. Actually, four times speed, but the only thing is special attack is not the good one. Physical attack is, but I'm not sure if there's any physical attack in the water. I don't learn Aqua Jet. It's a very good move. Aqua Jet, priority, physical, but still. But still, um. I don't know what else it learns, but it's not. I wish I had my tablet on there. I wish I had something like this. I don't have like a. Uh, I don't want to go to the place. I probably heard that I probably for that one. I think that's possibly a parent home or a neighbor home. I'm not sure. I'm not sure, so I'll have to find that in the video. I'm going to finish the video. What did you do? <clears throat> still, that was a This team, I think, is gonna probably like one of the best, my best teams I ever used to be fighting. And maybe, just maybe, if I can use one of this, if I can use this, like a, a brilliant diamond and shiny pearl. I'm actually gonna be doing a remaster of my original Pokemon Pro team. Obviously, I have to do some things like these two things, but like, that's at least. 2019 because I don't know why. I don't even know why it beats 2019. But still, it's crazy that it took that long to beat the game. Like, I was stuck in the area like before you get to the Galactic World House of the Hailstone. Not the, the the blue house, Virgin Galactic with the radar thingy. I think it is. I'm not sure, but the blue Galactic area and the Hailstone. I was kind of stuck in that area. Didn't know what to do. Now I don't know what to do. So, yeah. I'm also gonna be remastering this. I'm also gonna have my. I'm also gonna have my usual three of Torterra, Luxor, and Staraptor. If there are more fire types in Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl, I will definitely use a fire type because I don't want to use a Rapidash. Literally in Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl, or in these games, if I didn't choose Chimchar and have Monferno. I'm basically forced to use Ponyta. But there are other Pokemon that learn Fire type. It's like Metacham learns Fire Punch. Uh, what else is there? Skuntang learns Flamethrower. Garchomp learns Fire Fang. Um, Geodude learns Fire Blast, but I would not recommend it because it's a physical attacker. Well, in Platinum, they changed it up a bit. Flareon is no longer post-game. Yes, Flareon is post-game in this game. As you probably noticed, Flareon is post-game. You probably don't even know, but still. Flareon and Eevee is post-game. Which I think is kind of stupid. Stupid that Eevee is post-game. Um... And Waters post game. Houndoom post game. Arcanine post game. Like, there are some good fire types that can up that, to be fair. Like, they could have bought bad Pokemon like. Like I said, Arcanine. Like they've had Magmortar in this gen. It is Magmortar in this gen, but it's not in the Pokedex, which is kind of stupid. Oh, Spark on Pachirisu. I could have used a Pachirisu. I could have called a Pachirisu and used it for the Zubat. I didn't think of that. I was thinking about it, but like, Pachirisu is ridiculously weak. It's only good for like its speed, that's it. 
does get the decent good move of Super Fang, but still. That didn't. Why is it Egg Bomb? Are there other special moves I look like I'm not sure. Oh, Uproar. Gen 5 round. Like, there are some good moves that you could literally teach this thing. Like, I'm, I'm not sure if I'm not sure. Oh, it's pretty stuff in my mouth. Maybe it doesn't even have a Sacha Trent. Ah, Sacha Trent in the world doesn't even have a paralysis no more. Okay, let's practice this really try to just do a attack on me. I'm trying to bite down the bugs and then I'm gonna go straight to the back of the scene and then go ahead and the game plan. Nice, level 16. Two more levels and get sparked. And Egg Bomb missed because that move is ridiculous and very accurate. Beauty Fly. I don't have anything to take care of about Beauty Fly. I have my fur now, but it's a little risky. But Beauty Fly is really weak. Very frail, so it should go down for at least a fight or two. Wow, that fits so much damage. It's incredible hard. I also can't see the low defense stat. Yeah, it should go down to like a few. Imagine with the lose. It's the <laughs> It's the blue. You missed another egg bomb because it was garbage. It's like base 100. The move is like base 100. So it's 75 percent accurate. That's kind of bad. Man, I wish I was a fast forward option for this. Alright, let's go into my inferno. I'm not gonna use Ember. I was gonna inferno, I can't wait to go Ow! That didn't even look it's so ow. That did nothing. <clears throat> They did not do as much as I expected to. Spark. And a paralyze. I'm gonna lose to a Patrice with him in the corner. They still have good ground types this early in the game. Yeah, they got Mach Punch. I can't show up with Mach Punch. I don't have to worry about sacks, I'm already paralyzed. Here we go. <clears throat> Luxia level 6. Holy really crap, Luxia. I don't level my phone now. Never mind, I don't know really level 17. I think you hit with a Pachirisu. Alright, I'm gonna do another quick save. Alright, I'm back from the save. I actually put Beasle in the front because I was just a little. Are you freaking kidding me? After that battle, we get a freaking Prowse Seal. Oh yeah, these guys. Psychics. With the Abras, I think they both have hidden power fighting, so I'm glad, uh, uh, glad Lux is not a dark type. No matter who did, Luxray is a dark type. They should have really put Lux- they should- to be fair, in the main series games, they should have given- They really should have given Lux in that dark type thing. It looks like one as well. This is taking a while. It's all double battle. Hidden power fighting, maybe? I'm taking a chance. Yeah, I think they both have hidden power fighting. But they're gonna do nothing to chance. Come on, my precision is gonna oak cut them. <coughs> Like, if this was an Absol, I definitely would have taken it out. Especially with Super Luck. Super Luck is a very good ability. It basically increases your chance of a critical hit, so like, if you have moves like Night Slash and Psycho Cut, Psycho Cut's very good for fighting type coverage, while Circle Luck is like that. And Night Slash basically the way you can the for the back. Especially with them having very high critical rate as well. I mean, that critical hit, I mean, that critical hit ratio a bit more high with Super Luck. My Han's called my original diamond and super luck, and it has night slash, so it's actually pretty good. Once again, Han's was frail. 
just 20 minutes. 20 minutes. That's crazy. Insane. Nuts. Great ball. Like, really. I think we're about to hit the end of the forest. I'm not battling anymore. I'm not battling any more trainers to be, to be honest. I don't feel bad about trainers. Alright, now we're at the end of the forest. Right when we oh perfect timing to go up to the red leaf. Perfect timing, because I actually need to go to the next city and tomorrow we'll be taking care of Gardenia. Obviously a little bit more levels than everybody. But yeah, we'll be taking care of Gardenia tomorrow. So this is gonna be the real save, the final save of the the I'm gonna stop here save. But anyways, like I said, I'm gonna stop here because we really went to the city, went through the forest, battle command of Mars, basically did what I wanted to do today. Tomorrow, we'll be ba blah, 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 blah. excuse me, I'm just trying to mumble words. Tomorrow we will be battling gym leader Gardenia. I almost called it Erica from Kanto, but we will be battling gym leader Gardenia tomorrow. It's basically my phone strategy. Staravia would carry. But anyways, if you guys did like this video, please smash the like button. Get me to 50 subscribers. Subscribe to the channel. I should have said, like the video, I should have said it first. Subscribe to the channel. Get me to 50 subs. Turn notifications on. Set them to all so you can get every single upload. I'm not sure how consistent these bell is, but if you have a direct all, you should get at least every single notification. And follow me on my social medias, all in the description below. And with that, I'll see you guys tomorrow when we battle in later. Good day.